We were with Rayon Freeman from Huntington Prep after a really close, tight game against yeah. Berkeley Prep, the host team here at the National League Best in Tampa. And what, uh, I mean, why was that game an overtime game tonight, man? Uh, they, they came out and played hard for the jump. They played hard the whole game. They hit shots, moved the ball, played as a team. Just a great team, great coach, and they ran their sets. Did everything their coach told them to do. We kind of came out lax. We didn't really play as hard as we should have, and they went to overtime. You know, with Huntington, you know that everyone's going to come at you guys yeah. with their best game. That's kind of the part of the reason why you go to a school like yeah. this, right? Yeah. How much does that get you guys better game in and game out when uh, you're getting that kind of action? It's a target on our back every day. Um, it's you got to prepare. Uh, everybody wants to beat us. Um, if you beat us, it's like you win a championship. Every game is a championship for some teams. So we got to come out and play hard as a team always. Today we was lax and it showed. You know, you're a battle-tested guy being from D.C. You played yeah. Bishop O'Connell last year. You played for one of the loaded programs out of Richmond. What does it mean to be a D.C. guy? Uh, like, what kind of traits come with something like that? Uh, toughness, toughness. Um, we produce a lot of high major guards. It's kind of like a guard town. Um, yeah. I would say one of the best conferences being the WCC, which I played in last year. Every guard's tough. Every guard wants a name. Everybody's trying to make a name for themselves and make a high major. So just being a D.C. guard, you know, you got to be tough, scrappy, and just play to win every game. So for you, like, that experience playing at O'Connell yeah. and now playing here at Huntington, how is that preparing you to be a guy that not just goes to college but is ready to play as a freshman? I'm um, just competing at a high level always. Um, like I said, WCC is a great conference. Yeah. A lot of high major dudes. Uh, we just, you know, it's it's good because some guards may go out some places and play against low competition. Then we get to college, can't translate. On um, me, I was granted to play with two high major high schools, playing two high major schedules, in and out, always competing, and it's. Good for college because a college coach wants somebody who knows how to win and compete always. Well, let's talk about that a little bit. What schools have offered you a scholarship up to this point? Um, Ole Miss, Oklahoma State, Florida, VCU, GW, LaSalle. Um, I just got Texas and m this year. It's Murray State, it's a couple more I can't think of. And then what about schools that maybe have an offer but you know are going to be active in your recruitment? Um, I don't really know. Um, UConn texted me a lot, TCU, and um, that's about it right now. Have you taken any visits or unofficially been on any campuses at all? Uh, yeah, I took an unofficial to Oklahoma State, okay. uh, unofficial to GW, and I'm setting up an official right now in Ole Miss next month. Okay. It's just it's your first official? Yeah, first official. Got it. Let me go back a little bit. Oklahoma State, what was that trip like for you? Oh, it was great. I love the campus. I love the atmosphere. Great coach and Mike Boynton. I'm a guard coach. Really know how to play and coaches guards to be good. Uh, great guy. Who would you say the other one that you visited? Uh, GW, GW coach, okay. Jamie Christian, yeah. great coach, really knows how to win. He's been to a lot of schools, but he keeps a winning record everywhere he go. And that's the hometown team, so that's always good. What will matter for you when you sit down and really, like, when it's time to make it serious and, like, find the one? Like, what are the things or the thing that you want to find the most? Relationships. Yeah. Um, me and my family are big on relationships. Who makes me feel comfortable and who I'm comfortable being around? Mainly, um, a coach that's going to keep it honest with me, not tell me something, and then when I get there, it's going to be different. Just keeping the same energy from the yeah. jump and really wants to coach his team and win. Any, anybody standing out early on with you? Ole Miss. I love Ole Miss. Yeah, why? Why is that? Uh, their coaches, they've been consistent with me since ninth grade summer. Uh, they've been on my tail. They really call and contact a lot, and it makes me feel comfortable. So you go down there on official, I mean, is there a chance that you say, you know what, this is it? I can't say all that yeah. right now. <laughs> not on camera, right? <laughs> nah, not on camera. <laughs> Got to save something a little bit. I yeah. get it. I get it. Well, congrats on the win tonight, and best Thank luck you. to you guys tomorrow. Thank you.